Hey everyone, welcome to this video in which we are going to learn how to use bookmarks in Power BI and keep a reset button in the dashboard. So if you are watching this video for the first time, please do subscribe to Power BI Studio and stay updated with all the Power BI tricks. Let's get started with today's topic. So in the filter section, we can see that there are two slices. One is for the year and the other is for the month. Uh, so because of this all the visuals in the dashboard are showing us the data only for the selected time period which is December 2022. Now with a single click we can reset all the slices like this. Let me show you how this can be done. So uh, here is a similar page where I have not added any reset button. To add this uh, go to insert buttons and then select black. Yes. Uh, let's place the button with proper alignment so that it is like properly visible in the canvas and now go to style turn on the text and let's name this uh, button as reset let me also change the font to 10 and the font size we can increase it to 14 yeah this looks fine now let's uh, fill the button with uh, some color uh, so let me choose fill and then make the color as yeah this orange uh, we should now <coughs> assign some action to make it work in the we want so uh, go to view and select bookmark let me add a new bookmark and name it as reset underscore bookmark so as we create this bookmark we should ensure that the slices uh, are all selected to all otherwise the function may not work properly and it will like end up giving us the current selected option as output when the uh, reset button is actually clicked so it should be all as always when we are creating the bookmark now uh, select the reset button under the format pane uh, expand the action to turn on the button select the type to bookmark and we will be able to see the new bookmark that we have uh, created earlier in this video. Select reset underscore uh, bookmark and now we have provided the action to perform for this particular reset button. In order to see if it's working fine, let me select some uh, random options from the slices. I'm selecting FY 2022 from year and uh, April, May, June from the month slicer. So now we will not be able to directly click on the uh, reset button. What we will have to do is we will have to hold the control key and then uh, click on the button to see if it's working. So as you can see, uh, this uh, reset button that we have added now is working absolutely fine. So like this, we can have the uh, use the bookmark option in Power BI to use it in the way we want. Say if we had to uh, keep it for uh, financial year 2022 alone we can have a separate bookmark named as 2022 and then select it accordingly uh, so with this we are done with the short video on reset with bookmark option in power bi uh, see you in the next video and don't forget to power bi studio